Hi friends, welcome back to my channel, Miss Kid. There are numerous things that come to our mind when we look up at the sky, including why does sky appear blue and red at sunrise and sunset, or why do the stars align in particular design? All of these questions can be answered with the basic study of astronomy. So friends, in this video, I am going to share my experience with you all. I study in Shivnath School, Faridabad. My school had organized an educational trip for us at Kepler's Observatory, Manasar. It was a very informative, educative and interesting trip for all of us. So I thought of making a short video to share the same with you all. Friends, do you know who was Kepler? Johannes Kepler was a German mathematician, astronomer and astrologer. Kepler is a key figure in the 17th century scientific revolution. He is best known for his laws of planetary motion. Kepler's observatory is recognized for deep sky observation, satellite designing program, rocket launching, stellar curiosity and many more edutainment programs. It is 65 kilometers away from city light Manasar Gurugram. Kepler's observatory has India's largest telescope which is a collapsible telescope. It makes the sky appear clear and close to you. As you all know that we have 8 planets in our solar system, we were able to view only 3 planets at that time. The first planet that we saw was Venus. Venus is the second planet from the sun orbiting it every 224.7 Earth days. The next planet that we saw was Jupiter. It is the fifth planet from the Sun and the largest in the solar system. Do you know Jupiter also has five moons and we saw three out of those. And the third planet that we saw was Saturn. Saturn is the sixth planet from the Sun and the second largest in the solar system. Friends, most of the things that we can see at night is stars. Do you know how stars are formed? A star is a hot ball of mostly hydrogen gas. The sun is an example of a typical star. Have you heard of nebula? Nebula is an interstellar cloud of dust, hydrogen, helium and other gases. Nebulae are often star forming regions. They are vast in size and hundreds of light years in diameter. The nebula is barely visible to the human eye from the earth. There are many such cosmic observations that can be done in the Kepler's observatory. If you have not yet visited, do visit the Kepler's observatory and enjoy the science of astronomy. I hope you find this video useful. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also share this video with your friends. I will see you soon in another video. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.